Hey guys, in today's video I would like to show you how you can use one of these uh, Bluetooth uh, Classic or Bluetooth Low Energy uh, examples for Android Studio and uh, customize this uh, application for your own purpose. But uh, if you want to make uh, several applications, then uh, each uh, one of them has to have its uh, own and unique uh, package name. For example, this application has a uh, package name eu.cyberpunktech.ipmic or uh, in this case it's com.facebook.lite So uh, every application needs to have its own name otherwise uh, it's gonna be considered uh, as the same application and you may overwrite your previous uh, application in your phone so let's get started and so uh, we can start uh, by downloading this zip so when it is downloaded we can open it and i am going to use bluetooth classic example and uh, i'm going to use only this uh, android uh, project so I'm going to extract it over here. And now I'm going to rename it. So I'm going to name it uh, as a gimbal. So this is going to be my next project. And I'm going to move it to my Android Studio Projects uh, folder. So I store uh, every project in one folder just for convenience. And now I can open it in my Android Studio. So I don't need this one, neither this one. And I can try to open it. Here it is. Okay. So now I have to wait to let it build the project. So we need to index everything, etc. So we just have to wait for a while. So now I'm going to update this plugin and now we can go on and try to rename the package. So the package name is over here and uh, also the package is uh, in this manifest file. So it's over here, com.example android bluetooth chat. So I've been starting off this uh, example, so I can try to rename it to my own package. So you can right click and go to refactor, rename, rename all, EU. And also you need to look for this old package name. So I'm going to copy just for convenience. And uh, I'm going to look for these uh, artifacts later. So uh, if uh, something doesn't refactor itself, I will try to correct it uh, manually. So now I'm going to rename this uh, another package part. So in my case, I would like to name it as Cyberpunk Tech. Okay. And also 
I'm going to refactor this one. Rename Gimbal Do Refactor and also this last one. Just the Bluetooth. So this one was EU dot Cyberpunk Tech dot Gimbal dot Bluetooth. Okay. And I would like to also rename uh, these Java files because they also carry this Bluetooth chat name. So I would like to rename this also. Just get rid of this chat word. Okay, and now I would like to search this term where it is at. So it seems like it's everywhere. EU dot. Oh, it seems to be over here, but whatever. So over here, okay. So let's try to build this project now. And I've been using uh, Ctrl Shift F to search everywhere. So that's how you can do it. Okay, it seems to be fine, but I also used to click on build, then clean project. And also, uh, I recommend you to click on File and uh, invalidate uh, cache and restart. So this is going to clean everything. And this is going to possibly correct uh, the whole errors you might have. So this is the way how we can uh, resolve many things. So as you can see, it is indexing and soon it's going to be built successfully. So okay, I can connect my phone now. Okay, and now I can try to launch it. So 
so it's currently installing it is being installed launching activity and it works let me just increase the brightness of the screen so here it is and it works and I still carry name Bluetooth chat, so let's correct this one. So it's here in rest folder, values, base strings, and uh, app name. You need to rename this app name. So gimbal. Let's rebuild this and relaunch it so now it has a new name gimbal let me switch view so now it is basically it's a new app and now it's just a uh, all about uh, changing the code so this is all for today's tutorial so i hope you found this uh, useful and uh, you can customize and make multiple android apps for uh, since now so uh, that's all thanks for watching bye